Uh, welcome to another video to another Mother's Science reaction. I don't want to be his friend is what this is called. Hmm. Let's to this one. I think we need to hash things out. What, what do you mean hash things out? Let's, just, just, let's sit down and just, let's, let's talk about things. Let's talk it out, guys. Yeah. Dr. Phil, we're talking about things. Yeah, let's talk about things. Oh, it's my seat, dude. Oh, okay. First time here. Yeah, you can sit over there. Hey, wait, would you need me while you're up? Can you get me a beer? Sure. Thanks. Larry, anyone? No, I'm good. No. Sure. You got him. No, I'm good. I, I, this is almost. No, wait. All right, thanks. I got you. Thanks, thanks Mike. Appreciate you. your drink. Oh. See? It's going to take me an hour. Yeah, 45 minutes at least. <clears throat> All right. All right. All right. Let's make things uncomfortable. Well, let's get down to what's going on here. I, I don't know why you're looking at me for like I would well, be sure. Well, obviously you you don't like Weber for some reason. I want to just get down to like what is the problem? Because Weber, you don't have a problem. You don't have a problem with him, I don't. right? Can I start? Sure. All right. Listen. First time we met, I caught a bad vibe. You were in a bad mood. I was trying to be as as pleasant as diffusing as I could. Why would so, you, well, so, first of all, why do you be diffusing in a situation you have no idea about? Well, because... So usually when you're being diffusing, you're going into a situation knowing there's something going on. Did he talk to you about me before you got here? No. no. I just sure? wanted... Why would I talk to you? Yeah, 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 I'm talking to him. We're hanging out. His <laughs> new friend comes in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, first of all, new friend... This is exactly what I'm talking about. What do you mean? No, yeah, no, 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 finish. No, no he's finish. talking about who to you. You can't finish. Can I finish? Finish. Okay, look. Okay, I you come in. Me, friend. I'm catching a vibe. To you, he, you are new. You seem like you're in a bad mood. You're all upset. We're playing Mario Kart. Really? You threw the controller for a video game. I lost my temper during the game, but you had to team up with me, and then he was nonstop kissing your butt about how great you are in Mario Kart. Like he made a freaking break, dude. Like, we used to play it all yeah, the time. He, you guys play with yourselves. It's not my concern. Uh, Video games, please. <laughs> I, I was kidding. I was trying to. Yeah. I know. Good. Good way to keep and it that's the way it should be. Keep it in light like yeah. that and everything. I mean, yeah. I don't I understand. I mean, also, furthermore, furthermore, for the record, I, I thought it was a bad idea to pull the prank on you with the podcast. Right, Larry? Yeah, that is true. Yeah, I'd be scared of this. He, he asked me, he said, it, he, he said it wasn't is Dad going to be alright with this? Yeah. I told him, I said, we prank each other all the time. Well, because we already had a prank. I don't talk about that prank. Yeah, well, I don't, I don't, I don't call it about it. So, I didn't I have been called because I was laying on pretty freaking thick. Well, why? Because I don't like you. Okay. That's, what sure. want, that's what I want to try to understand. It's like, why don't you like him? He's yeah. condescending all the time. What do you think? That's what you know what you're talking about. What do you mean, condescending? That's how I am. Oh, so you're condescending. Oh, so it's cool to have well, condescending people. He doesn't well, call you condescending to you. I, mean, I, don't, I don't need it like that. Have you heard the way he talks to me? I hear the way he talks to you. He talks to everybody like that. That's the way he talks to everybody. I'm a nice guy. I'm sorry. I try to turn things around. No, he never even thought of me for being a nice guy. I just don't think that you're being a nice guy and that you're being condescending. That's what I, I didn't mean. They, they apologize. I. So. They got my nice guy. So I don't that, know. That's what you're assuming. I don't know. I like to. That, that, Larry says you're a great guy. Yeah. So here, here's the thing. Like I want. <laughs> I don't understand why it's funny. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, tell me what you feel. I, I'm curious no. about Dr. Phil. Tell me about how you feel about the situation. I'm Dr. Phil. I wish I could talk like him. I wouldn't pretend that I was him right now. Everybody would be classic. No, what I want to know is why... No, I can't. Why... Does... What... what you know, you're, you're saying you don't like him. But what... But other than... This, you... you your perception is that he's condescending to you. He is. Which it's, I don't. It's not my perception. Think, it's a fact. I, no, it's not only your fact because it's your perception. No, it's, it's not. My perception is my reality. Exactly. Have you not said that to me a thousand freaking times? Oh God, that's what I'm trying. Your own perception is your reality. Like your point. You have a T-shirt made. Well, can you say it's your damn mind? But that. But I believe that, though. I mean. Oh, of course. So then you know it's my reality. Then. No, it is. Don't call my perception. Call my reality. That's what you believe. Well, that, no. your reality. Okay, okay your reality. You know, to change the reality. He's letting cut you off like that. Well, this is your last. Okay. Not Weber's last. Trying to help. cut me off too, so it doesn't really matter. It's okay for both of you. I've been here for years. But well, your reality, your reality is, is that Thank he's you, condescending. I, exactly right. right. I appreciate My that. reality is when I listen to him, he's not being condescending to you. This is how Weber talks to everybody. Right. 
Tom, is this how he talks to you when he talks to you? So he's a douche to everybody what you're telling me. That doesn't make any better. I don't think he's been a douche to anybody. I think he's been extremely nice to you. <sighs> I think your reality is for some oh, reason. Oh, I think it's cool that there's somebody else's job and written nonstop because his buddies are doing it. I I mean, no, don't I was trying you to fit in, Joe. I was just And that's trying what to I was trying in. to say to you earlier when we were having that conversation. Fit in with who? People you've known your entire life? I don't feel like I had to fit in with you, Jeff and Terry, to have known you guys for 30 years. If you know somebody for so long, so yeah, you, have to, you, you have, shouldn't you have, have to, to fit understand in. That, like he, he's only met you a couple times. He obviously has a problem. And that you, and then we already talked about this because I asked you to right. chill out. He did. And then he chilled well, out. And I'm glad he told you because I would have really punched him in the freaking throat. But he did chill out. I'm not a bad guy. I'm sorry. Yeah. I wouldn't really punch him in the throat. But that's what I don't understand about it. Like, <coughs> you know, everything was cool, and then it's just like, you're all of a sudden, you're not like that. He didn't do anything. First of all, I'm not talking to you. And then all of a sudden, that you're like angry with him. No, you said, let's have this out. Let's have a conversation about our freaking feelings. And now that I'm having feelings like I'm a bad guy now? No, I'm not Joe, saying Joe, you're a bad guy. Joe, I'm not saying that at all. You're in sales, right? <coughs> this guy is in sales. He knows I'm in sales. <coughs> you know? That's what I'm talking about. I'm coming with you. Let me how is that something bad that he said? Let me find common ground. This is how it's good. You know in sales, you try and make people feel good. You try and make people like you. What is this? I'm doing the sales thing. Yeah. Listen. You try to make people like you. That's all I was trying to do. No, I don't. I feel you're trying you to make the Larry group. like you more. And no. Jeff and Terry at my expense. Larry likes you. That doesn't. He, that doesn't. He, he likes you back then. He likes you now. How long have you been going? Oh, well, I, well, I, well, he's, people change. Well, he's, well, he's been going for a few years, but that's yeah. irrelevant because it's, it's not irrelevant. Well, it's irrelevant to you. It's not irrelevant to me. No, I'm just saying. This guy comes in. He's so good. Look. First of all, I, I don't want to be I don't want to be true to anybody, and I, I I'm I'm sorry that I feel this way about you. It's honestly how I feel about you. I feel like that you're being purposely condescending towards me. <coughs> the majority of our conversation, <coughs> that's how I feel. That's my perception. <coughs> Therefore, according to you, Larry's Wall is my reality. It's not Larry's Wall. That's well, actually real. I mean, it's like I don't have anything to say besides you, but I'm, I'm jumping on there. Perception is their own reality. Exactly. It doesn't, point. It doesn't okay. mean that it's absolute truth. It just means that it's your sense. reality. Oh, now you now you decide to go further into your theory. Well, I don't think I ever had to explain it to you, and I probably did before. You just don't remember. What does this supposed to mean? Well, I probably explained that to you. Well, why would I remember? You say I'm a dummy. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about. You're, I think you're oversensitive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really yeah. do. I think you're. I think you're. First of all, he's allowed to call me oversensitive. You're not. Okay. No, okay. Hey, let, okay. Right, if so I call you oversensitive, so piss you off. Work with me here. Work with me. Yes. I'm not buying a freaking car, dude. He's so just not to work with him. He's just asking you a question. If I'm too nice to you, you don't trust me. If I'm trying to fit in, no. Uh, if you were too nice to me, I would much. understand. Okay, he's being overly nice to everybody being said that I would get that. But you're not. You turn to being a jerk <laughs> right over that by busting my snow's not bad. Uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. In, in your defense, I was kind of a dick to you the first night, and I apologize, right? <laughs> okay. And it. it, it Maybe the second night too, and pop the third night. But for you to go, if you're trying to prove me that you're a good guy, you would be like, okay, maybe he's defensive of his situation. Let me just keep on. But you jump right in with them real quick when it's easy to make fun of the weak guy in the picture. You decided to bully me in front of everybody else, and I don't think that's cool. I don't think he did. Of course you don't. You know what, Joe? He's your boy. Listen, Joe. He does. He does. If I made you feel that way, I wholeheartedly apologize. And that's it was not see, my intention. See, that's what I was talking about. I who said I who said apologize? Who in reality says that? Isn't that what everybody does? Is I'd be like if you if you I'm sorry. If you wrong somebody, you should apologize. Be unapologetic, but listen, I know when I'm wrong if I'm wrong. I don't understand what your problem is. Are you serious? No, I seriously You don't hear He's trying to be nice to you and trying to say that he's sorry if he offended you. Yeah. Yeah. And you're not accepting I hear that. You. I hear that. <laughs> Joey is. You know, I also hear how what? you're saying it, Weber. Don't fool me. You treat people like, right. Like, you're reading you know, it. Yeah, you're reading like something that he said. Other than what he said. I think he's reading. I don't. 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 Yeah, I know. That's what he's doing to me nonstop. But I want to ask Tom because Tom's a, a bystander here too, right? He's he he saying everything's that to going Joe. on. I want to ask Tom. 
Tom, do you think that Weber is being like condescending to Joe and being ignorant to Joe and all these things? I was ignorant. I said condescending. Two different things. He was trying to be apologetic to you, and you was, you were like, you're, he's not even apologetic. I wholeheartedly apologize. What do you think, Tom? Do you think for being is Joe being way too much? The way that I'm being. But I'm sorry that you can't understand See, where I'm coming from. See, that's not fair, because it's I like, you don't want to get involved in this. He's apologizing to me. Yeah. Yeah. It sounds like you're sarcastic. I don't want to get involved in this. Smart. Yeah. So he's apologizing to you. Apologize to someone. I just think that... I think yeah. he's not apologizing for what he's saying. He's apologizing for how I'm taking it. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry you're taking it this way. Yeah. Yeah. Don't put it on me. You're the one apologizing. Don't put it on me. And Larry, Tell me you're sorry for the way I'm taking it. He's sorry if he offended you, aren't you? Yeah, totally. Tom's as a child. That was not my intention. And Joe, shoot. He's my friend, you're my friend. Can't we all just be friends? I'm, I'm so glad. Let's be cool. You did not say, can we all just get along? Because I would have just walked the hell out of here. <laughs> that would be ridiculous. But seriously, can we... No, no we can't. I don't think that... Maybe, maybe, maybe. But if he said he's sorry if he offended you, why shouldn't you be okay I'm, with that? I'm going to take this at face value. I'm taking it at face value for your consideration. Okay, this, is your so this is your friend. All right. But I'm not being turned a blind eye in the situation that's going on. Okay, all I ask is... I think that that apology at face value. Okay, so okay. all I'm asking is that you be civil to him. He'll be civil to you. And try to be more a little a, bit, a little bit more um, conscious about how sensitive... How kind of sensitive he is. Or, oh. yeah, yeah. Try to, I don't know how you can change how you talk to people. I don't know how that's possible, but... I mean, even that, that, no, that... You're just saying that he's right and I'm wrong. No, that, I'm not. That's exactly what I you told know, No, no, no. I've known him yeah, no, no, I don't exactly know how. what you just told him. I just don't know how... I don't know how you can change what you're talking about. Can I finish what I'm saying? Can I finish? I don't know. I don't know how he can change the way he talks to people because I've known him for a long time. This is how he talks to people. Everybody, not you. He talks the same way to me. Everybody else. He does not talk the same way. I can't. I think you need to listen to the way he talks to me because it's the same way, Joe. I think that you're just being oversensitive. Okay. I mean, it's an effort. You say he's right. I'm wrong. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. This is. You literally just said I'm being oversensitive. Therefore, it's my problem. That's what you just told me yeah. about. Seriously, it's, it's all about problems. It's all of our problems. Let's exactly. work it out. Why not your problem at all? It Listen, is, because I'm in the middle of this. We want to work this out, but, I mean, taking a previous <laughs> attitude is not going to move it forward. You, you won't even listen to him. Who says <laughs> but like that? But, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> talks. It's how he talks. It's how he talks. This is what I'm saying. Oh. You don't want to react to things. Anyway. We we gotta start the podcast very soon. Right? I can't freaking wait. Me neither. Listen, the only reason why he's over here. I mean, the only reason why he's here, he's not replacing you, Joe. He's here to bust my balls. I know. No, I get it. He wants to start his own podcast, so he yeah. wants to learn how the ropes are on this. Stealing your thunder. So I'm, we're going to try to teach him how to do a podcast. What? Now what's wrong with that? Nothing. So we're going to teach him, and then he's going to do his own podcast. Yeah, nothing and, and, and it'll be back to the way it used to be and everything. But he's just learning how to do one now. That's it. Interesting. All right. Can we all just get along? Would you help me, Joe? No, I... No. Would you help me? I'm not talking this. You told Larry about how... I don't... Do you hear what he's asking? Do you, are you listening to how he's saying these things? Yeah. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Seriously? The way he's talking to me. Okay. Maybe I try to think the way... Maybe I am being nervous. If I am, I will apologize and I'll be mad at that. But I don't think that I'm over... All right. Let's all just shake on it. And let's keep... Let's keep yeah. it. Yeah. Let me shake. Yeah. Yeah. Is there something we're Come on, Joe. No, let's shake oh, hands like a man. Come on, Joe. Come on. Come on, Joe. I'm not hugging him. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. All right, that's the end of this real estate team for the next one. I think I'm going to bury Papa one more.